And you might remember the days of letting a repairman into mm -hmm. your house to handle all of the fix-it projects. Well, we know that that's so 2019. Yeah, now one local company is showing it can get with the times. 13 Action News reporter Trisha Keene shows us how it'll work. Gary Jones recently had an issue with the water filter underneath his sink. It stopped working um, and I had no clue what was going on. He tried fixing it, but says it made things worse when it started leaking. Gary needed help, but says he didn't want to call a plumber. I have a mother-in-law living downstairs um, in our unit downstairs, and she's highly at risk. Um, so we're being extra safe. Gary decided to reach out to Fixer.com, a virtual handyman service. We're helping people with anything from um, a, a toilet that won't stop running to mounting a TV on a wall. Company founder Mike Evans says... His traditional in-person service moved online as a direct response to the pandemic, and business is good. We've done hundreds of these now. Fixer has experts in plumbing, electrical, paint, and more, all lending an ear and doling out advice. It doesn't take rocket science to learn how to, say, put a TV on a wall, but there are about 80 wrong ways to do it and three or four right ways to do it. And just having somebody tell you the right way to do it, it only takes 10 minutes. Um, but it, it can save you hours of frustration. It also saves hours of searching the internet for the right how-to video. With a screwdriver and a coach who can see and hear um, what you can see and hear, we can get through the vast majority of things in a person's home. The first five minutes of your live chat are free, then 15 to $30 for every additional 15 minutes. People were looking for a contactless service, but it's turned out to be so effective and so much more efficient and affordable that this is here to stay. Gary says the service definitely worked for him. They were really quick um, in, in assessing what I need because I, I sent them a photo, I think, beforehand um, of underneath my sink and kind of where the issue area was. Gary says he plans to use Fixer again, pandemic or not. My wife wants these toilet bidet things that you add to your toilet seat, um, and I would probably need them for that. Um, that, that's a little bit outside of my scope. For 13 Action News, I'm Trisha Keen. And we have more information about Fixer's services on our website. Just visit ktnv.com slash rebound.